Hello guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can bypass FRP, remove FRP within Samsung A12 phone. It has been kinda a problem and an issue several times, but now I'm going to show you how you can do it very fast and easy. So just follow the steps along the video, you will see how you can do it within no minute. Here you click on Pandora tool. Then you open it as an admin. Then you wait for it to open very well in the computer. You wait for it. You just try to be patient whenever it's logging in. Sometimes it takes long time, but it opens it very well without any issue. Wait, as you see, I'm waiting for it to open. Sometimes the phone takes long to respond, but you have to be patient. You click OK to accept the logins for the tool. Actually, this is a lot. Uh, this this tool is a paid version. Um, you have to first connect the computer to the PC. You connect the PC to the internet so that it responds very well. If it's not connected, it cannot open. That's the problem with the login Pandora. But if you have a, a box, it opens immediately without any issue. Here you select the brand or the model of the phone. Then after you click select, then you will see this interface. You click on the three dots on top to select where you want to flash. Now you look for where there is. You click on the format section and click on list of RP. Or if you want to wipe the phone, you click on wipe. Or to read the firmware, if you want to flash it, you flash using the side of flash. Here you click FRP, then you click on the buttons of the phone to make the phone to respond to the computer. If the phone refuses, like mine has refused, then you use the test points of, the, of that phone. If you don't know the test points of this one, you can check in the video. I've tried to show you the test points of this one. You can check them out. That's the test point of Etrel. Then the phone will respond automatically into the system. You let go, you release the test points. Refresh the phone, removing FRP. Yeah, as you can see, it's showing erase FRP done. Then now that means the phone it's totally done to erase FRP to remove FRP. Then you put the phone on and start. The So thank you guys for watching, please subscribe to this channel for more tech videos if you'd like to be helped out.